Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to iterate pre-chat information filled while initiating a chat. So whenever a visitor initiates a chat, they enter first name, last name, email, subject uh, and uh, whatever additional fields we have added in the pre-chat form. So if you want to iterate those uh, values, whatever the visitor has entered and then if you want to route the chat accordingly then um, we can make use of omni channel flow so let's see how to do that so i have created a chat button the name is chat with flow and uh, i'm using omni channel flow for routing so let's look at this flow the name of the flow is chat flow so this is the flow it starts here and immediately it will loop through the pre-chat information so first we have to create a record collection variables with the name pre-chat info uh, this pre-chat info variable is a standard variable uh, so when you create it please make sure it is case sensitive so here i is capital so make sure it is available for input select the data type as record and the object should be conversation context entry always make sure allow multiple values collection is enabled if we miss any of this step we won't be able to get the pre-chat information whatever the visitor entered into this omni flow even the name is also case sensitive i should be in uppercase okay so i'm using a loop element in the flow i'm looping it from last to first you can also do it from uh, first to last for each element i'm having a decision i'm checking whether the key is subject so we have first name last name email and subject so i'm checking whether it is subject if it is subject I am checking, I'm, I'm assigning the subject value to a variable called str subject. So first it will check whether the label is uh, um, subject. If, the, if it is subject, then it will go and assign str subject uh, variable with the value whatever they have entered in the, um, uh, <coughs> in the subject uh, field. So once it is captured, I'm doing a decision here so decision is simple here I'm checking whether str subject is service if it is service it will go via this if it is not a service then it will go to the default outcome so if the subject is entered as service then it will go to this particular flow else it will go to this default outcome flow okay so in the skills check if it is service so if the user entered subject as service i am doing a service skill assignment so here i am assigning service skill as the skill requirement and then i am routing the chat so i am routing via skills chat and this is the record id even this one should be declared even this record id variable is case sensitive um, make sure you are creating with i capital letter so here i have created that variable and then for skill requirement i am using the service skill requirement in the previous element it's a value skill requirements and i am using a routing con routing config uh, routing configuration here so let's say what let's see what happens if the customer hasn't entered subject as service it will go to the default outcome it is assigning sales as the skill requirement and then it is routing via skills i'm using a routing configuration here also so this omni channel flow first checks all the pre-chat information like first name last name email uh, phone and subject if it is subject it will go here 
and then it will check what is the value it will assign the value of the subject to str subject variable if the variable value is uh, service it will go to service queue if the va if the value is uh, other than service then it will go to sales queue so in order to demo this let's initiate a chat and see it so as an agent i am going online This is my embedded uh, service deployment. I am using the button chat with flow. This is the same code I have used here. I am going to preview it. I am going to start a chat here. So I am entering service here. So now the chat should be routed to an agent with the service skill. Yeah, the chat is routed to me. Let's identify whether it was routed via service skill. See, the service skill is used here. The chat was routed via service. Now I'm going to end this chat. I'm going to initiate another chat. So now the ch chat should be routed via sales skill. See, the chat is routed via sales skill. So if the subject is entered as service, it will go to service skill. If the subject is entered uh, um, other than uh, service value, then it will go to sales queue. You can have your own custom field in the pre-chat. Uh, I have used the standard field subject. So uh, for your um, based on the use cases uh, you get, you can define your own variable and uh, you can also pass that variable dynamically or uh, you can ask the users to select it and you can loop uh, the pre-chat information, find the uh, correct key and then check its value and based on that you can route the chats. Thank you everyone for watching.